You're about to preview an important law enforcement training program. The entire program is available by license only via our learning management system at lineofduty.com. For licensing and use information, email sales at lineofduty.com or call 800 462 5232. Coming up on this edition of In the Line of Duty. Tension on the streets of Baltimore. A hostile crowd, jittery cops, a man with a knife. The cops have guns drawn. It's a bad combination for all concerned, and it comes to the worst possible conclusion. And the entire incident is caught on videotape. Every officer out there knows that edged weapons are a serious threat, it's a high-risk threat, and certainly an officer can be seriously injured or even killed when confronting somebody with an edged weapon. But during this time, like I said, he gripped the knife very, very tight, and he also was gritting his teeth. So I took it as a hostile gesture, you know, especially when he stepped forward, and I was in fear for my life, so I fired my weapon. It was a costly shot. The man died. The shooting officer lost his job, and it cost the Baltimore Police Department a half a million bucks. Good things can come in big packages for law enforcement. We'll look at some potentially life-saving equipment for tactical responders just out in the marketplace. Lessons learned by the officers involved in the line of duty. Lethal force incident always takes a heavy toll, and the incident you're about to see in Baltimore was no exception. Hello, welcome to In the Line of Duty. I'm Ron Barber. And I'm Don Marsh. Although an officer fired the fatal shot, bystanders may have been a huge contributing factor. Clearly that, some mixed signals, and sloppy tactics all played a role. To view this entire law enforcement training course, email sales at lineofduty.com or call 800-462-5232. It is only available by license to law enforcement, criminal justice, military government, and educational institutions. Again, that's sales at lineofduty.com or... 800 462 5232.